Hey everyone, welcome to our crazy kitchen. Hello. My name's Katie, this is Paisley, and this is Kinsley. And we're going to do some baking today. Um, so what we are going to start doing is out of the Big Fun Kids Baking Cookbook from the Food Network, we're going to choose one recipe every week that we're going to do, either out of the Baking Cookbook or out of the cooking one, which looks like this. That's the cooking one. We're going to pick one recipe out of them, and then we're going to do it. And then after it's in the oven baking, we're going to cut the videos. And then we're going to do another video of a little taste test these girls are going to do. Um, yeah, so we're going to get started. Today we're going to make confetti magic bars out of this one, out of the baking cookbook. And these are what we're going to make. That's what the girls picked for their first, first go at this. So for the recipe, you need one stick of butter. So I have it all measured out here. And you're just going to melt it in the microwave. So I'm going to do that, and then the girls are going to stir up something else here. So the next ingredient that you're going to use is some graham cracker crumbs. So I bought the crumbs pre-made. Sometimes it's fun with kids to let them break up the graham crackers and stuff so you can stand on your chair. But we made it easy today. So what you need is two cups of this. So, Kinsley, you're going to scoop out one cup and you're going to put it in this bowl. You want me to pour it? But you need one cup. This is one cup. Okay, and then we'll let Paisley do it. Okay, here Paisley. You need one full cup. So scoop one big cup. I'm just going to help Paisley a little bit. This is our three-year-old. Good job. One cup. Okay, Kinsley, you want to do one? Well, but we need another cup to make two full so cups. So we'll use this one for something else. Okay. okay. So we're using two full cups. Two cups. Do you want me to pour some in? It's okay if you make a mess. That's one thing, cooking with kids. It's a little bit more work. Oh, Kinsley's got to measure one full cup. Dump it in. Here. That's good. That's it for that ingredient. The nice thing about this, I don't think it will matter too much if you add in a little extra. Whereas sometimes if you add in not enough or too much, it won't work. Here. Okay. Now, with the melted butter, we're going to pour that in and mix it into the graham cracker crumb. So yeah, Kinsley, watch the bowl's kind of hot. So pour it in, and then Paisley, yeah, pour, 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 pour all of it in. Awesome job. Okay, I'll get that out of the way. Paisley, you start stirring that up. And while Paisley is stirring that, we're going to get our pan ready. So Kinsley, here's our pan. Stand up in your chair. And we're just going to use some spray for our pan, Kinsley. So you just go, just like hairspray. Yeah, all over. Okay, I'm going to help you. I got it. Okay, but one steady, you want to do one steady spray. Perfect. Okay, now let me just get those few spots you didn't get. Oof. That should be good. Okay. <laughs> How's the stirring going, Paisley? Mm -hmm. Good job. So I'm going to let Kinsley stir this up a little bit, or I'll just do a little bit here. And then I'll let Kinsley stir a little bit. So super easy for the base for this recipe. All it is is butter and the graham cracker crumbs. Are you guys excited to try these after? Do you want to do a quick little stir, Kinsley? Okay, 
So once that's done being stirred, we're gonna, going to put that in the pan that we just sprayed. It's a 9 by 13, well ours is not quite a 9 by 13, but what the recipe calls for is a 9 by 13 inch pan. Uh oh, that's okay. Good stuff. And now what we're going to do is we're going to pour this into our pan. You want to scrape that in there? Oh, I'm in. Yes, okay. Ginger's going to do some and then you're going to. Yeah, good job. Okay, now she's going to do some. Good job. Do you guys like helping out in the kitchen? Kinsley said yes. If you didn't see her move her head. <laughs> good job, Kinsley. Okay, I will help finish this off. Okay, a little bit more. Good job. Tap, 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 tap. Tap, tap, tap. Awesome. Okay, let me get the last little bit. Mommy, I need to. Yep. Okay. Now, what we're going to do is just spread that out on the bottom. And then we're going to give it a good tap down. So what I'm going to do is give the girls each one of my little round bowl and they're going to push that down so can you like say where you're at yeah, you're doing it. I'm, doing my hand. Well, I'm just gonna scooch you over a little bit hold on hold on hold on hold on i'm not gonna use these bowls and just push our cuff down so can you like say all you're gonna do is this push okay 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 here you go Good, helping. You're just going to pack it down. Like this. Perfect. Okay, that's looking good. I think we're just about ready to add on our next few things. We'll just do around the edges a little bit more. Good job. Okay, I think that's good. Okay, now we're just going to set those bowls to the side. You know, we're going to add everything on top. Okay, so what our next ingredient is, is sweetened condensed milk. So I could not find a 14 ounce can of it. Um, so I'm going to use one can, a 300 ml can, and a little bit more of another one. And what you're going to do Maybe is just do it pour it on top. I have to open it because it's kind of hard to open. So, you're going to pour it all over, Paisley. So, not in one spot, all over. Good job. So, you're just pouring it all over. I'll move that bowl out of the way so and you can see. I'll do the next one. Good job. Tip it right upside down, Paisley. And we're not going to quite use this full can, maybe. And we're just loading. A little, about a third of the can I'm going to use. Good job. So can we not all of it? That's probably good. Good job. And now what you're going to do is you're just going to spread around, um, spread it around. You're not going to mix it into the bottom. You're just going to spread it nicely on top. Can I do? Yeah, I'm just going to scrape out. Yeah, can you just scrape? <laughs> Paisley wants to just do everything. I'm gonna do. My, I'm gonna use my pink one. Paisley, yes. Yeah, let me show you what you're going to do. So, listen. You're not gonna mix. You're just gonna spread it. Nice. Or actually, that's not working too well. So what I'm gonna do instead is I'm just gonna tip my pan. I think that'll be easier to get it to move around. Because it's just gonna bring up the um, graham cracker crumbs. Oh. Okay. So we're just letting it. Touch all edges of our pan. See? Mm -hmm. I like my help. <coughs> and then we get to add all the yummy stuff on top of this. Yeah, sprinkles, some chocolate chips. Sprinkles, mm -hmm. chocolate chips, some nuts. Okay, so that's nuts. good. That's what it looks like. Mm -hmm. Now, I just gotta wipe my hands here. Yeah, because you guys <laughs> this one. Now what we're going to do 
is start adding on our other ingredients. So what we're going to start with is some chopped pecan. So you're, yeah. So what we're going to do is add one cup of chopped pecan. Yeah. So here, I'm going to measure it out, and you guys are going to sprinkle them on. So perfect. One little bag is one cup. So you're each going to take these and sprinkle them on top. Go ahead, Paisley. Everywhere on top. Sprinkle, sprinkle. This is a great recipe to deal with both of them because they can both be doing stuff. So make sure you get some in the middle too, okay girls? Over in that corner, Paisley. It's kind of like when Paisley puts stickers on a picture, it's always in one corner. <laughs> Not over the whole page. But she's slowly learning. Good job, guys. And we put it on TV, right? And then we're going to put some over here, Paisley. Paisley. Looking good. We need a little bit right here. There's none right there. Okay, awesome. Okay, so there are our pecans on top. Do we do these? Well, those are more pecans, but we don't really need them. We have enough so for what the recipe calls for. Now we're going to do one cup of coconut. So this is shredded sweetened coconut that we're going to do. So again, one cup. And then the girls can do the same thing. They can both. Use their, Use their hands again and sprinkle it on top. Sprinkle it everywhere. Paisley's got lots for here. Let's like spread that out just a little bit. <laughs> okay, good. Good. Okay, now. Can I wash my hands? Sure, you can go run and wash them quickly. Mom. I'm just going to spread out some of these little piles. Mommy. Oh, you're just wiping it on your knees? Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. Well, after we'll go wash our hands, okay? And now the next thing we're going to add. It calls for two different types of chocolate chips. Uh, dark chocolate chocolate chips and butterscotch, but I did not find butterscotch, so I'm going to use these peanut butter ones instead. Yep. So it calls for one cup of these and one cup of the dark chocolate, and I just have pure semi-sweet chips, which mm -hmm. I will use. So one cup again, you guys get